Hello guys, I'm Holly and welcome to a dollcore try-on haul. This big package just got delivered to my door, so we're gonna unbox this and then I'm gonna try all of the items on. Everything that I ordered should make a really cute dollcore outfit. Let's open this. Imagine I open this and then it's something completely different. No. It looks like clothes. <laughs> As you can see, all of the things I got are from Romway, but I am not paid to promote anything in this video. I'm not sponsored, I'm not affiliated or anything with this brand. And I bought everything with my own money. This is the first, ooh, this is huge. I'm guessing this is a dress, let's see. <clears throat> what? Oh no, it's a cardigan. <gasps> all right, oh my goodness. Let's see what it looks like. I'm so happy. Yay, this is so cute. Wait, why are the buttons upside down? This is a really cute cardigan and the buttons in the middle are hearts, but they're upside down. I think I can just twist them. I don't know. <laughs> I hope that they don't twist back, but we're gonna see once I try it on. It's in this creamy color and it has white lace in the front. I love the little bows on the pockets. This is something I don't have yet. I don't have a cardigan with pockets. For some reason, a lot of cute clothes don't come with pockets, but every time there are pockets, people are happy about that. I think there should be a lot more pockets on cute and adorable clothes. And this cardigan has pockets and I'm very happy about that. I can already tell that it's a very soft material too. Although I have a feeling that if I wash it one time, it probably won't be as soft anymore. Right as I put on this cardigan, I felt extremely cozy and happy. And another thing that would make me happy is if you would subscribe to my YouTube channel, if you like try on hauls and vlogs, this is the right channel for you. We are trying to collectively reach 100,000 subscribers and I know that we can do it together. I'd be extremely happy. Thank you. Not only are we on the road to 100,000 subscribers, but we're also on the way to Halloween and my Halloween outfit or costume idea has changed. The next package is a bit smaller because... Hmm, I don't think this is runway. It could be a couple different brands, but most of the things are runway. These are just two ribbons. I love making pigtails or like two braids on each side and I thought that would look really cute. Or even if I have my hair open, it would look very adorable. And if you braid your hair, you can braid these in. And one thing I do with ribbons is I actually curl them with my curling iron. Just do it on a low heat. Doing that, you can get out all of the wrinkles and you can have them look more like they're part of your hair. <laughs> I think they're gonna be so adorable once I put them on and curl them. Let's talk about Halloween again. If you're going to dress up for Halloween, let me know in the comments. I wanted to dress up as a fairy, Harley Quinn, etc. And I even tried to make fairy wings, but it kind of did not turn out the way I wanted. So my next idea is or has to do with this video. Maybe you can guess it. The next item is this dress, and this is a mini dress. It's black and white. I think that if you try to make a doll core outfit, taking either cream, beige, a pastel color or white as your main color, and then adding little black details is so adorable. Hence, when I saw this, I was like, this is perfect, and I have the perfect little gloves to wear with this. The gloves I was trying to wear with this dress were in the wash, but I can definitely see myself taking an Instagram picture with this dress and the gloves, so make sure to check out my Instagram. It's holly.series, just my name. It's the same name as YouTube, just with a dot. 
instead of the space between my name and my last name. The next item is a plain little cami top. I think this is gonna be too big. I bought this to wear underneath sweaters or clothes that might be a bit see-through because sometimes sweaters can have holes or maybe you're wearing a blouse and for that I wanted to have something underneath. Therefore, I don't think it's too bad that this is a little bit too big and it's very stretchy. Hmm. But it's cute. I like the way it looks. All of the items that I've purchased are great for fall, but also winter. Especially this cami top is going to be great to wear under clothes because I get really cold and I have to layer up. You can never go wrong with pink and it's two different types of pink. It's a dark bubblegum pink and a very cute baby pink on top. As you can see, this is a mini skirt. This also looks too big, but you know, I always sew my mini skirts anyway. I remember when I saw this online, it was on sale, which probably is part of the reason why I got it. But it's also very adorable and I don't have a mini skirt in this darker bubblegum pink at all. I just hope that it fits me and I don't have to make too many changes, but I probably will have to, let's be for real. This skirt fits like I have to get a sewing machine soon. <laughs> I sew everything by hand and I think I'm going to take this in, not just at the waist, just the whole skirt. I'm gonna make it all tighter and I might even make it shorter, but I don't know yet. I didn't mean to buy lingerie, but it just looks so adorable. And what is this? <laughs> Hold on. <clears throat> Every time you get lingerie, you, first you have to figure out what. Wait, I'm sorry, this one. Um, I think it's a crisscross. Chris? What? I'll just have to try this on to figure it out. <laughs> but it's so cute. I probably have to also um, go back and try. Uh, what? Ta da! Okay. And it's a special crisscross because it starts here i thought this was so cute so i couldn't say no it's a pastel pink with two bows on each side a waist strap it's lacy it has frills it has bows it's perfect for me waistbands always help accentuating your figure they always look flattering but now we're going to move on to the next item which is thigh high socks or tights wait they look very short but yeah, they're super stretchy. <laughs> anyway, they have the frills on top. These go around your thigh and then there's a bow here. With these tights, you have to be extremely careful when you want to wash them because, yeah, the bow is only glued on. It's always the same. You have to sew this on or you have to hand wash, all right? When you have it on, you can see the beautiful pattern. I would style these thigh-high tights with thigh-high boots in black. Just imagine the frills peeking out on top. That would just look so darling. If you have a different idea on how to style any of these items, let me know in the comments because I'm actually thinking about making a lookbook. The next item kind of goes together with the previous one. I'm pretty sure they're leg warmers. Let's see. Yes, they're the leg warmers with the pom-poms. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. I already have white and pink leg warmers, but I don't have any with pom-poms. They're so adorable. Any sort of pendant always makes the outfit super cute and more like doll-like. <laughs> While I'm filming the try on parts, I'm actually watching an anime that is all about dressing up. It's a 
it's a comedy slash romance. I really like that genre, but it's almost over and I need a new one. So if you have any recommendations, please, please, please let me know in the comments. Thank you. Other than that, I just want to say that I'm extremely grateful for every single one of you guys. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for watching part 1. Part 2 has already been uploaded by the time most of you guys are watching this video and is linked in the description box down below. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye bye.